today. Another week being tired, another week going by. Uh, certainly happy that we have a uh, football season uh, still going strong. We just had a, a, a game on uh, Friday, uh, won that game. The next game is also here. Well, not also. I think it's against a two-way school, so. Uh, and then we have uh, one more game after that. And already, they're already having, like, uh, basketball meetings. And I, I'm assuming it's just to uh, gauge on what the, the strength is going to be for next year. And I already talked to the, the coach and he already said that uh, they have at least, I don't know, it could be like 20 or so. So you know, that's a pretty good sized team. And, and uh, for like JV, it, it uh, it's, it's kind of a good thing because, you know, that, that allows them to, you know, pull from that. Uh, that means the... Uh, Varsity is probably going to be not as uh, full all the time, mostly just because there's going to be a lot younger talent uh, in the pool. Because there's a lot of kids, I think. I mean, I'm not even sure who's who's playing, but I I know that there's I think a handful of of seniors and there's quite a few uh, freshmen and and whatnot. So like it's. It's it's pretty cool. I uh, can't wait for that to start. I have uh, have a couple new jackets that I bought. I've already worn one of them. I didn't like. I don't like the way the sleeves kind of got a little scratched up. It seems like, and I'm assuming it's just the material that it's made out of. But uh, this one I have on. Uh, I've had for like two years now, and it's already faded. Not all the way, but almost. Uh, but yeah, I liked it, and since it only costs like, I don't know, like 20, 25 bucks, uh, I know I only have this year and next year, and then I don't have any more kids in school, I, I hadn't even really given a thought yet as to um, future uh, endeavors, anything that I might even encounter is, I don't, I don't know. I've never been in this situation and, uh, I do know that my kids being here kind of doesn't allow me to think about it that much, uh, because they're here and that's why I want them to be. I don't, I know that they're going to be adults and they're going to move out and they're going to do their own thing. I get it. That's just not what I like. That's not what I want. Not that I would want to, you know, buy out a whole cul-de-sac and have my whole family live in it. It's not even, not even what I would want anyways, but I guess just my kids, I would rather them at least be, uh, close enough just in case they need help or uh, advice or uh, someone to vent to. I don't know. Whatever it is, but I, I, I want to be there instead of being like three hours away. Which my oldest is. Uh, three or four hours away, you know, it, it really uh, it really sucks on on our relationship because there's no uh, contact. I mean, it's it's not like I can sit there uh, and do things because not there. So um, right now, I don't have to worry about that with my, with the two younger ones yet. I think the uh, middle kid is he's going to do whatever he's going to be doing in college. Uh, but I don't know if he wants to uh, move out 
right away or or see how everything goes because it's it's pretty hard uh i know when i moved out when i was younger and had totally different situation and everything like that but it's it's a it's a really big eye opener knowing like the things that you you're responsible for uh or need to pay attention to or or uh keep up on you know with cars or house or you know yard like a lot of things uh but when you're when you're a kid and you don't have to do all of that stuff you you just don't know it until you have to do it you know uh one thing that my my kids don't have to worry about is you know the 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 little things cuz they've they've done all of that stuff uh the the place that they're going to be going to whenever they move out hopefully is a way better situation than they have now not that it's bad but i just want them to uh have something for themselves uh you know make something out of themselves so they have the opportunities uh, it's it's not easy and it, depending on where you live at uh it could be hard to to find a place to live or people to be around or you know friends like a, a lot of things are uh are up in the air and, and and chance and uh sometimes you have to to take what you have but the one thing you can always look back on and and uh help keep yourself you know in the right direction is is uh, just being positive and and knowing that even if it sucks right now it it might not suck in the future it might not I'm not saying you'll never you know not get any better or any worse like you never know i have no idea but i do know that if you if you just stay in the gutter you're always going to be in the gutter right if you stay uh negative you're never going to be positive so maybe i'm not always positive but i don't really see it a lot of times where i'm not unless when i'm by myself and you know and in, in, in having a uh, like in, internal dis, uh, discussions or or you know things that i think i need to to change about myself and it, it's certainly not a lot a lot but i mean for me like even the the small things like time management that right there is uh it's a small part of my life but it's a huge part of it because it really reflects you know uh being punctual or uh things i need to get done at, on time because um, there's deadlines for things sometimes uh like i just have to be more uh, observant and and more self-aware and that's really all it takes uh there's more to it of course but you know it's everything is learn as you go but you have the internet so you can't really uh you can't really blame much to anything else if you can find the answers out beforehand so yeah i can't wait though we have another game like i said and uh there was supposed to be another video game coming out i can't remember though but we'll be streaming that when that comes out whenever that is i, I literally i was trying to thought of what it was um but at least i i, I said it <laughs> so i'll remember now since i said it but Oh, I do need to buy, I don't know what I'm saying it, but I do need to buy like this, a really huge gallon water jug that I, I don't have to like worry about, um, breaking all the time. Cause I, I use, you know, the ones you get, you know, from Walmart and everything like that, that has the handles, but you can only use them for so long and then they start breaking or, you know, they, 
the the actual plastic itself I can't really use it it's just pretty disgusting so I don't know why I said that I just did because it's on top of my brain anyways not much else I guess I love y'all I'll talk to you later have a good week